They're also getting another weapon back in Joey Gallo. He's been swinging the bat extremely well, but did not start yesterday due to neck tightness. I spoke to him today during batting practice to ask him what it's going to be like facing his former team. It's crazy. It's uh, I never played against them, so it's, <laughs> it's it's weird being on the other side. Um, but yeah, it brings up a lot of emotion, a lot of, a lot of memories. Just been there for a long time and. Um, but I'm excited to play against them and hopefully, hopefully, hopefully win. How difficult is that to leave a situation where you're so comfortable, you spend your entire career there and quickly at the deadline need to pivot? Yeah, that's, it's, it's been, that's the toughest thing I have to do in my career, for sure. Um, you know, it's just, it's two different parts of the, of the world, essentially, as well, and two different markets and stuff. So uh, that, that was tough. I mean, you get like a one night to pack all your stuff up and, Guess what? You're playing for another team the next day. So um, that's tough, but it's part of the business. And uh, I'm happy, though. I really, really enjoy it here. And we got a great team. So I'm excited. I'm looking forward to making a playoff run with them. The offense has been a little bit of a roller coaster ride for you guys. What can you do to try to find consistency down the stretch? Yeah, I, I mean, you know, like I always say, it's all you can do is show up every day and work and you know, let things work out themselves. You know, uh, I think if you put too much pressure on yourself and uh, and that, that it can be make it even tougher and we just have to approach it as let's play the game let's have fun do our homework and uh, you know things will work out but uh, let's just show up and play hard and I think good things will happen from there. And Gallo spent about 15 to 20 minutes speaking with the Rangers, the Texas media contingent. You can tell there were a lot of relationships there. He spoke about how much that organization meant to him. He was the first pick for the Rangers, uh, 39th overall back in 2012. There are some more injury updates. Domingo Herman not yet added to ro the roster, but Aaron Boone said that could happen in the next few days. And Jamison Tyone Bob is expected to go on a rehab start on Wednesday, and then the Yankees will make a determination thereafter. But as we know, including tonight, 12 games left. Time is ticking away for Tyone.